We've been talking about it the last little bit here. Tomorrow, a unique fundraiser for the University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics, Stead Family Children's Hospital. The man sitting directly to my left, Mr. Drew Pearson from West Music. Justin, thanks for Good having us. Good to see us. you, sir. How are Likewise. you? Likewise. Doing well. How about the, yourself? I'm well. The gentleman next to him, Dr. Isaac Samuel from the University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics. That's correct. Look at this. And not only is he a doctor, he's going to sing here in a little bit. This behind us, Doctors in Concert. Talk about this event. This is such a unique, cool thing to put on that you guys have been doing. West Music's been sponsoring it. Dr. Samuel, you've been a part of it. Kind of give me the background of how this all got started. Sure. So this series began in 2014 and ran through 2017. In those four years, we uh, raised close to $30,000 for the University of Iowa Children's Hospital. And uh, then we had plans to bring it back in 2020. COVID put a damper on things, mm -hmm. as it has many things. And this is the first year that uh, all the pieces have really fell into place at the same time. And we mostly have uh, Dr. Samuel to thank for that. <laughs> he was instrumental in recruiting talent, uh, figuring out logistics. So uh, just so happy to have him driving the bus, so to speak. And you, you, you uh, Dr. Samuel was here for Soundcheck this morning, so we kind of got to visit a little bit. To have something like this, first of all, is unique, where people can see their doctor in a completely different, you know, perspective. But to be able to have the buy-in from your colleagues and have this maintained for so many years has to be such a great feeling. Yes, it's wonderful. It's really nice. Uh, it's it's a uh, it, it, it's where uh, charity and uh, music, the arts, combine together. And it's for the children's hospital, so that's a, 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 that's a wonderful thing. As you reach out to your, your colleagues, are you surprised? Like, oh, I never knew you know, such and such could drum, or I never knew such and such could shred on a guitar like that. I mean, I've seen their stitching work, that's great, but I've never seen them shred on a bass. Are you surprised by that? Yes. yes <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I, I think this event just goes to highlight the overlap between the arts and the sciences. Mm -hmm. you, whether you know it or not, many of your favorite physicians, professors, are likely to be accomplished artists as well, not just musicians, but you know, visual arts and all of that kind of thing. Um, who knows why that is, but I, I heard a rumor that one of our favorite uh, TV personalities might be, a, might be a good musician as well. Chris, do you know how to play an instrument or that one? Really? Uh, uh, the cowbell. She, she plays a mean <laughs> triangle and I am, I am a you piano player, player and an right? organist, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. But I'm not a doctor. You don't need me up there. But <laughs> maybe you guys, next year. Maybe next year, I'll come help out. <laughs> what a great event. And uh, it's coming up on uh, tomorrow night down in Coralville. Right. Tell yeah. me a little bit about the venue and what people can expect when they yeah. come to it. Absolutely. So it's the Coralville uh, Center for the Performing Arts. That's 1301 Fifth Street in Coralville, across from West Music. Again, that's 1301 Fifth Street in mm -hmm. Coralville. Um, and you can uh, go to our website, westmusic.com, and RSVP there. You can also donate in advance there. Um, or you can simply show up to the venue, 8 o'clock, Friday night. And uh, admission's totally free. We wanted, we wanted to be as inclusive as yeah. possible with this. So donations are... Um, uh, recommended but not required so it's kind of the old-fashioned pass the hat free will offering that's what we're doing yeah we're <laughs> I'm Catholic and it reminds me okay of the plate. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so um, yeah show up and enjoy a great show it's uh, the, the the caliber of the performers we have from top to bottom it, it's surprise it's it's phenomenal I mean yeah. if these guys weren't doctors they'd be out earning a living doing what they do well and, and doctor how many different acts are, are going to be on stage. It's not just uh, show up, all right, 10 minutes, you're done. This is a full bill that you guys have. Yeah, uh, yes, I think uh, totally there are uh, six different uh, performers and groups, mm -hmm. totally. And each one could be uh, doing more than one song. Okay. Uh, so it goes from uh, uh, like solo singing to instrumental to group uh, and entire variety. What's it mean to you from your perspective? And then, Drew, I'll ask you the same question, too. Mm -hmm. from, from the working at the hospital every day, seeing the patients come in, but now you're completely flipping the script, and now you're helping support that by having fun with your colleagues and just doing it in a completely different light. What's that mean to you? Oh, it's, uh, like, first of all, it's a fun thing to do uh, for uh, physicians. And uh, most importantly, it's, uh, it's a wonderful thing to contribute towards uh, the children's hospital. Uh, like everyone has got a personal connection mm -hmm. uh, to the children's hospital. And Drew, same question for you personally and from West Music's perspective too. Oh, sure. In a sense, it's about uh, 
I guess you could say cultivating community. Mm -hmm. um, it doesn't matter if you're a doctor or a carpenter or a piano salesman. Um, m music gives us this rich universal language to communicate with each other, and we all we all do it with the same 12 notes. Yeah. Um, so you can go sit down in a group, and, and you'll see that on the night of the concert. There are some groups that haven't performed together in a public setting before, but because they know the melody, the chord changes, mm -hmm. and the form, they can sit down and, and, you know, really, really make some art together. Details, uh, we'll put them up on screen for you one more time, coming up tomorrow night down in Coralville. Uh, and you're going to get a performance here in just a few minutes. Uh, Dr. Samuel will join us with guitar in hand over at the big monitor wall and give us just a little taste of what you can see. Gentlemen, thank you so much for bringing this to our attention and letting us know about it. And uh, Dr. Isaac, by the way, thank you for the preview we're going to get here in just a little bit, too. Sure. All right, yeah. piano salesman, you want to take us to commercial break? <laughs> Oh, I should probably put it, yeah, to, there you go, right there. To play us out. <laughs> You're watching Everyday Iowa on KCRG TV 9.